How often should a guy have a guy's night out with his buddies? I don't think there's a formula that every, every person, every family, every couple should keep to the same formula. But um, I do think it's healthy both for the husband and for the wife to at times go out with their friends in appropriate settings. Um, one of the most important things in Shalom Bayit and in parenting is self-care, taking care of yourself. And um, unfortunately, in our very hectic society, lifestyles, sometimes we neglect ourself. And if we neglect ourself, we end up not being the kind of spouse that we want to be or should be, and not the parent that we want to be or should be. Should be. And um, I've seen many situations like this. Sometimes it comes with the best of intentions. I see, I see this with, with mothers. I see it with, with, with fathers, with husbands, who think that I'm, it's not, I shouldn't go out. I shouldn't take care of myself. I shouldn't go to a gym, let's say, go to um, whatever it is that's going to be to take care of themselves. And I think that this is a very, very big mistake. And ultimately, you pay the price for this later on when your fuse is short because you haven't taken care of yourself, et cetera. However, too much of going out and doing your own thing is also problematic and um, can really create a lot of stress and tension in a relationship. I was talking to a newly married guy who came to me and he said that he works in a certain place and a whole bunch of husbands who were married a few years longer than him were bragging about how much they go out. I go out two times a week, I go out three times, I, my wife stays home, I come back at two in the morning, I do this, I do that. And he realized that something's wrong with this picture. And I think that um, it is a very big issue and a big problem. Um, and um, you need to really find balance in it. I think that when, when a husband goes out um, it, it's, or a wife goes out, it should be supported by their spouse. Again, assuming it's appropriate setting, appropriate environment, it should be supported by their spouse. Um, the worst thing that a wife can do when a husband says he wants to go out is roll her eyes where, where her, her eye, you know, eyeballs go back to the back of her head and says, okay, go, like that, right? That, that's, that, that literally makes the husband feel like going out and not coming home, God forbid. Um, you, you, don't want, you don't want to do that. There are times when you need to stand your ground and say, no, I really you know, feel it's important that you stay home, etc. But I do think that, like with everything, we need to find the proper balance and it is healthy to, to go out. It's healthy to have you time. Um, of course, a couple by themselves, and it's not something that was mentioned tonight, but it has to be mentioned um, because it's so, so crucial that couples spend time together away from their kids. It's the best gift you can give your kids that you're taking care of your own relationship. I can't tell you how many times I see couples who think, oh, there's no babysitter good enough for my kids. Excuse me. That is an excuse and it's not okay because you have to find a babysitter that's good enough for your kids, even if it's not your in-law. You have to find a babysitter that's good enough for your kids because you have to spend time together. You have to spend time taking care of yourself. Support your spouse in their taking time for themselves, and then hopefully they won't take advantage of it. That, that was really great, Rabbi Greenberg. I just, you know, I learned with chatans, and one of the chatans says to me, he said, Rabbi, is this normal? Like, my wife wants me to go out the guys once a week. So I'm thinking, everyone complains their wife never lets them out of the house. This guy tells me he's complaining his wife wants him to leave the house. So I knew something was up. So I was like, well, what did you say to her, uh, you know, to, to spark this conversation? I said, Rabbi, you know what I said? I said, when we get married, baby, I'm going to be home every night, just me and you. <laughs> and I was like, he, this man, this young man is onto something. The wife wants you to be normal. She doesn't want you to stay home all the time, but she doesn't want to feel like you have one foot out the door and rather hang out with your friends than her. So once you say to your wife, babe, I'm home every night with you, that's it? She's like, oh, of course, yeah, that, that's not normal. Go out like once a week, How, you know? It's like Val Rubenberg said, you need some self-care, you know? But if you say, okay, uh, are, we, are we home again? Uh, uh, can I go out, can I, still, can I go out with, uh, with Boris and Vinny? So then, <laughs> so, so then, yeah, of course she's gonna want you to stay home and roll, and roll her eyes when you do go out. You know, I, and by the way, I just have one recommendation that guys, anyone who wants to go out with their, hus their friends, do not go out with your friends per week more times than you have a date night alone with your wife. 
All right, that, that's a good litmus test. You want to go out once a week? Fine. Make sure you go out just with your wife once a week, too.